This conference will now be recorded. Okay, we're discussing about the solar view. Because so whatever yesterday I have created, I have terminated that one right now. Just now. I have a large permission. Just now you can see still it is a You can see still it is doing just now. Just now I have launch permission. Trust me, I have taken. I have taken trust mission. Media mission. Already know, right? If you want to work on Sonar Q, you require at least media mission. That's why I have taken media mission. So already you know something about uh, Sonar Q. Sonar Q is a Java based open source static code under the tool to the signal source for quality okay by using only single command by using only single command like this what is the command i have to use here this one by only this single command i can generate reports this is the memory command right that's why in the same mission, man software should be there. Okay. Of course, already you know you have to do this command from the location where we are having a compile also. There is also the holder of that. At the same time, before using this command, you have to update the palm.xml. In the palm.xml under properties tag you have to provide sonar server url along with the id password sonar web url along with the token okay those things we have seen what is the port number default port number 9000 where you will find this in this location is good to use a default database for the database if required, you can configure your own database also. Okay. Now, let me. Now it is ready. Uh, still, it is installing only. Now it is ready, I think so. I will connect this one. One more time, I will install everything. Okay. So, because I don't have anything that's way. Daily, I used to terminate servers. Oh, give server. I am connecting. How to connect? Copy that command from the location. Here you have come from this one, come file actually, ABC. Now I am opening it bash from here only. Paste that command. Click enter. It was confirmation. Type yes. Now we are able to connect. Right now, what the easy to use up. Now in this one, I want to install Sonar Cube. Already I have shared the script with you to try to follow. I already have done one time, right? So now I want to quickly follow. Okay. Switch to root user. First one is switch to root user. Now go to OPT folder. So because in the OPT folder only, I want to download third party tools. That's why. So if you want to work on Sonar Cube, Java is the Prequid software. That's why let me install Java. Now Java is getting installed. Later, I want to download a zip file of SonarQ by wget command. Of course, by default, wget command won't work. That's why first you should install wget. Of course, after downloading zip file, 
you have to extract by unzip command, right? That unzip also by default won't work. So try to install double get and unzip. This is the command for that one. Now it is installing double grand also. After this one, I am downloading zip file of this Pangip server from this URL by double get command. This is downloading. Later, I will extract this one by unzip. I will extract it. Now it's extracted, right? You can see this one. It's extracted. Now, what to do already, right? Of course, I can start in the solar cube, in the solar cube under pin, under Linux 6664. I can have one file called solar.sh. Let me show you. Let me show you where it is. The solar cube, the bin. Under line x64. This one is there, right? I have to execute this file to start, but as a boot user, we are not supposed to start. As a solar user, I have to start, right? That's why it requires to create a solar user. How to create a user? You know this command, right? Add user. Okay. I am creating one user. Personal user. Once you create any user, that user can update in the two doors file. Two doors file. That's what I am doing now. I am opening two doors file. If you go down here, at last, you can have an entry for ECT user. Like that, you can see. At last, I am having this one. Similarly, for uh, solar user also. I wanted to maintain one entry like this one. So that's why hit enter here. Now I am adding something. Yeah, it's bull. Sorry. So I saw our space save. I made it like this. Whatever is there, try to make the same thing only. For this user also. Right? After that, we have to change the permissions under one issue. Ownership. Earlier root root is there. Now I'm changing it to sonar sonar. Let me change it. permissions also. Now I will go to the location and I will first of all let me switch to sonar user. Later I will Change this location OPT so our cube bin line x x64. And in the location, now you can see in this I have this file, so it's same file. Now I do this how to include so many ways are there as of now. I want to use this one star slash that file name start. Of course, before start, let me check status also. If what is the status. You can see it's also not running right. That's why I want to start now. Just yeah, start. It's very mistake. Now it's going started. Let me confirm the status one more time. Mm. Now it's going running right. Okay. Now it is over. Keep it aside. Now, of course, we are launching machine itself. I have opened all the port numbers. Now let me try to access from the home URL. How to access that the server? Copy the public IP of that server. Okay. In the browser, paste it. Colon. Port number, port number 9000, right? 
now i am able to see the home page this is the sonar gib server home page actually this is not coming this one right now okay it is asking me to log in so immediately if you want to log in you have to use here is a says admin 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 only i am able to log in right this one i am able to log in this is the home page because i, I don't have any projects now okay now already you know right if you go to mn sonar call and sonar command the corresponding sonar cube report will be generated in this project tab right if you go to mn sonar call and sonar command you require maven software right that's why let me show maven software of course right now if you observe here i am a sonar user so don't uh, try to go to as a solar user try to exit some solar user okay try to exit some solar user exit now you can see in the solar now two failure only now as a root failure i am at opt now in opt only i want to install maven software already you know maven software installer system i have shared with you hmm. the other steps you have to follow to install maven already i have root user already i have installed java i have installed wget and anji pass admission so no need to do these four steps that is what i am trying to say so because already i am root i am in root user already earlier i have installed java in this server now why to install one more time you need to try to install so of course nothing will happen that is different okay Yeah, now I want to download this zip file of this Maven. Now it is installed. Sorry, it is downloaded. Let me extract this one by using this unzip command. It is extracted. This one. This is what I downloaded Maven. Later I have extracted. I got this one, right? Okay, keep it aside. Now I want to set up home path right for Maven. That's why try to do these three commands separately one by one without skipping anything. Of course, don't do these steps multiple times also. Only one time you have to do them. If you do multiple times also. It won't work. Now my Maven software is ready. Let me confirm. M V N I for version. This showing Maven three point eight point two. That means my Maven is ready. Maven software is there. Now I want to do it. So I give command called M V N. Sonar, colon, sonar. Can I do it here? No, we because if you want to do it, any Maven commands, uh, we require some goals there, right? Sorry, some format XML. Here I don't. Here I am not seeing any format XML, right? Of course, where you can see format XML, along with the source code, developers they are maintaining in the GitHub, right? In the GitHub only I can source. I can see that the format XML, right? This is my GitHub account. In this GitHub account, in this organization, I am maintaining. This is the repository where developers are maintaining source code along with Format XML. How to get this uh, entire repository into server? In this server, I want to have that one. By the Git clone, I can get it right. By the Git clone, 
git plot won't work because i don't have git software first of all let me install git software then use git plot command how to install git software simple command m install git to iphone way i can give you before or after no problem you can see m install i can get or m install git iphone whatever Now get it installed. Now I want to download by git clone command. Git clone is a command to get the entire repository from GitHub to the server. Okay, git clone command followed by the URL. Let me copy that URL from the here. Open code, copy this one. Use it here, that's it. Now it is downloaded. This one. This one, right? Just add on this one. Let me go inside of that one. How to go inside of this one by CD camera, right? CD map application. Now I'm inside this one. Here I am having format XML along with some source code. I'm leaving my terminal. This one. Okay. Now in this format XML, I have to configure, right? I have to I have to do some modifications in the format XML. Let me open it in a editable mode. VA format XML. Now, of course, you don't worry about uh, everything. You have to observe only the properties tag field as of now. If you want to work on solve cube. In the property tag only, you have to verify. No need to verify what there is the other thing. Based on the tool you see, you have to observe the corresponding tag. The tag which you have to consider to work on so I'll give you a property tag. Okay, under property tag, you have to make sure you have given correct so that you are all under credentials or not. That one you have to identify. Okay, as of now, you can see something 30 to the 3, 193. That, that is the previous server, right? Now, this one, right? This is a different one. That's why right. use this one there. Copy. Uh, now, paste here. Paste here means uh, go to insert more first. This one, right? This is the previous URL. Now let me paste the latest URL. This one, right? This one only. That's it. Of course, you, you, you know, right? You can use login ID and the password. Otherwise, instead of using both of them, there is only single token also. Whatever you want, you can use. Preferably, you can use token. Anyhow, I am okay with the registry because this is a default, so again, you know problem. Okay, escape colon W. Save on a bit. Now I am okay to execute EMN solar colon solar command. So because in this location I am having format XML, already I have installed Maven, already I have configured format XML with my Sonic URL and ID password. Now I am good to execute MN. Sonar colon sonar command. Sonar colon sonar command. Right? <coughs> Already know right? what will happen if you use command. I can see who should do no. No, no, no. There is no. I can do this command as any user. Only for starting the service, only for starting solar cube service, we should be a solar that's it. Of course, you can you, you cannot you cannot be a solar user. That's what is question, right? Today. So right now I'm a root user. I can do this command, no problem. Only for starting. Starting of the service. That means uh, I'll show you this one. 
You can see here, right? In this OPT, Sonar Cube 7.6 bin, under Linux something, this file will be there. To start this one only, we should be Sonar, that's why I am switching. Later on, you did not use Sonar, that's the different. Okay. Anyhow. Now it is doing something. What is doing right now? You know this one, right? It is downloaded from central. Same process for Maven only. What are the difference I mentioned the format XML? It is trying to get from the Maven local repository. They cannot find a local repository at very first time. So it is trying to get those things from the Maven central. That is what it is doing now. Now build is success. Now I can see one report there in the uh, Sonic Service project tab. This one right just now. You can see time also 6:25 just now. Okay. Just have generated. It is showing password, so no need to worry. Of course, I have some issues, but they are not passable. That's it. You can see I have one honorable ten house, six sports mails, but they are not, they are negligible, I can say. If I am seeing this status as false, we don't worry what is there also. Of course, we won't bother about them. If you have anything, bugs, we have to what? We have to worry. But if you have vulnerable and sports mails, we don't worry. If you have any bugs also, we are not responsible to clear them. But we will intimate, we will intimate developers, they will work on it and they are responsible to delete those bugs. That are different. Okay. Now, anyhow, my project report is showing, my sonic report is showing password only. So, I don't worry. Now, if you observe in this output, in this build, it is using. Of course, in this project, I am having some Java code, I am having some JS, and I am having some XML code also. In this project. That means in this source code. In this source code. In this means uh, in this source code. In this source code, I am having some XML code, I am having some JS, and I am having some Java code. That's why for all of them, it is using Sonar Wave only. Already you know the reason, right? Why? Why means? This is, called quality, this is called quality profile actually. What is the quality profile? Collection of rules. Collection of rules. What are those rules? Those are predefined rules. Those are predefined rules. How to select them? Of course, normally for each and every language, you can have predefined rules. Where you can see them under Sonar Cube, under rules, you can see all the rules. Corresponding to each and every language. Already I told, right? Solar Cube, suppose by Solar Cube, I can generate Solar Cube reports for 16 different kinds of language. 16. Total 16, see. For these 16 varieties of languages, I can generate reports. That means I can check source code quality of all these 16 kinds of languages code. Okay. Right now, in my code, I'm having some Java code, I'm having some JS3 code, and I am having some XML code. That's why it is using so I'll refer for only those three languages. Okay. Now definitely nobody is going to use the default um, quality problems. Based on the project requirement, based on the project requirement, we we'll have to create our own quality profile. First of all, what is quality profile? Quality profile is a collection of rules. Collection of rules. You did not create rules. Already rules are created. Rules are created. They are maintaining here as a list. You can see totally there are these many rules. Total means for all languages. But if specific to Java, I can find that, find that rules. 
specific to C sharp. I can have three seven three rules. Likewise, for Ruby, I am having forty eight rules. Likewise, for the Go language, I can have forty six rules. Likewise, for CSS, I am having thirty rules like that. Okay. If you have any CSS code in your source program, out of these thirty rules, you can select some of them based on requirement. Who will tell you to select a specific code? Rules means definitely that will be tell by your project manager. Definitely somebody will tell you right. Otherwise, you cannot do. You, you don't know which rules I have to use. I have thirty rules. I want thirty rules. Which rules I have to include in my quality profile? That information definitely you can get it from your higher authorities in the in your company. No doubt about it. Right now, in the quality profile tab, I am seeing so many. That means for all languages, you can see first T shirt. I am having one quality profile for Sonar Web with the 238 rules. For C sharp, I am saying for C sharp, there is a default Sonar Web quality profile with the 238 rules. What are those 238 rules? Definitely, let me show you under rules tab for C sharp. Totally 373 are there. Out of from these 373, they have selected 238. Out of 373, they have selected 230. Likewise, for each other level language, they have selected this one. As of now, there is no use for generating for creating quality graph for C sharp. Why? Because in our source, I have only some Java code, some XML code, some Java, some JSP. That's it. So, try to create quality profiles for those languages only JSP, XML, and Java. Why? Because in my source code, I am having only that code. That's it. Okay. Now, let me, of course, let, let me see about Java. In Java, also, you can see there is a quality profile called Swanar Way. This is the default quality profile for each and every language. There is a separate quality profile with the collection of rules, but all of them will maintain the same name, Sonar Wave only, Sonar Wave. Okay, if you observe for Java, totally the five rules we have seen, right? But in this Sonar Wave profile, they have activated 375. Among those, out of those 530, they have selected 375. Okay, you can if you want you can use this one. So they they can cancel all this this and those. If you want to create your own quality profile, you can create your own quality profile. Creation you can activate what are the rules you require to use in the project. That's it. Okay, now I want to create my own quality profile. Let me keep it. Here. Already it is uh, time to put in open. I want to get my quality profile. How to get quality profile? Click on the quality profile. You can see there's a create tab, right? Create button. Quality is try to observe. Quality profiles are collection of rules to apply during the analysis. For each language, there is a default profile. The name is Sonar Web, right? All projects not explicitly assigned to some other profiles will be analyzed with the default. Ideally, all projects will use the same profile for every right? Ideally, Sonar Web, Sonar Web, Sonar Web. Now, now, definitely, we have to create our own quality profile. Click on create button. Now it is asking to assign some name, something like Hmm. I mean something whatever. My quality profile one. I am creating this one. My QF one. This is what I am going to give you name. For which language? For Java I am creating. Here it means none. Why? Because uh, of course already for Java. 
we are maintaining one profile with the three seven rules right like this right if you want to add some more rules for that one you can choose as a that one now what will what we see from from this to far away i am going to inherit all the three seven rules if you want to can add some extra rules also for this one if you want to you can do that one otherwise don't select that one okay as of now i am not selecting anything yeah. As of now, you can see in this row, quality profile. I have not activated any rules right now, zero activation. Now I want to activate some of the rules. Now the rules means totally five the rules are there related to Java. I want to select some of them. Let randomly I am going to select as of one rule. Okay, let me select something like 20 or 41. I have pressed some of them. I have moved it, assume. Now, for quality profiles, scroll down to see Java related quality profiles. You can see now. Already, Swarovia was there with the three sort of rules. Just now, I have created this so, quality profile my view of one with the 90 rules. As of now, this is default one, right? This is a default one. Now, if you do to MN solar power or solar command, now also it will take this quality profile only to check the source code quality with these three certain values. Okay, let me connect one more time session where we got the master. The session time would happen. Let me connect one more time the system. Twenty-four, yes. Twenty-four, yes. Oh, Okay, now copy this one, put it here. Now I am able to log in. Yeah. Okay. Now I have logged in. I am a ECT user. Let me switch to root user. I am at root user home. Let me switch to OPT. GD slash OPT, right? Now in OPT folder. Here only I am having everything. This is the folder where I am having project, right? Let me go there. CD. Man application. Now I am application. If you display here, I am seeing format XML also, right? Here only I can do 
Amen. One more time, I want to do the Amen. So, sonar, polar, sonar. Still, it is going to use default quality from sonar. Way. So, because right now, this is the default one. But no need to change here itself. If you want, you can change. If you want to make, you can make it here, right? Like this. Otherwise, only one more possible, right? One more possibility is there, right? What is that one under projects? Select the project. Okay. Click on administration. Click on quality profiles. Here also under Java, right now, with the default file, you can select this one as no problem. Now, only for this specific project, only for this specific project, even though you have not made this one as default, still it will take only this one. Only the project level has changed, not at all. More on. Let me show you one more time. On the part of profile, still it is there, right? You can see on the Java. Default is still this uh, software only. Still, this is a default one, right? This one. But if you try to execute this project, which one will take with? Not this one, this one. It will take my PF no because and left hand modified that one. Now, if you want, you can show you. Only for Java, definitely to take my QF1 as the quality from. You can see. Who it is taking? Of course, uh, even though in this quality profile, still I am seeing solar way the default quality profile for Java. Who it is taking my QF1, even though this is not default, means at the project level, I have changed. You can see at project level, I have changed, right? You can see. And the project level, I have changed this one. You can see under project level for Java, I mean this plus plus way. Okay. Anyhow, now for this uh, Java, I have modified. Let me try to create a profile for JS for XML also. JS for XML also. Use top command here so that there could not be any problem with server. Now, uh, I want to create Two more quality profiles for JS for XML. How to create? Click on quality profiles. Create something like um, I use something name Monday. Monday for JSP. I mean something like Monday for JSP. You can name right? No problem. This is for JS language. I am creating. For JSP, totally six rules are there. Out of those six, we can select some of them. Totally six are there. Let me select uh, at least two of them. I have selected two out of six. For JSP, total available rules are six only. JSP, this one, right? This is what Monday for JSP created with two rules. Now, I don't know, I don't know. Here I can make this one default, whatever you want. Now, for all projects, for all projects, if you have any JSP code in the project, for that one, to honest source code quality, it will use. This quality profile with these two rows, these two rules. So because overall this is default now this way. Of course, at any point of time, if you want, you can make this anything as default. Otherwise, at the project level also you can change it. This requirement you can do anything, right? If you know, you can do anything. That's it. Now similarly, let me create quality for JSP, sorry, XML also. Create. 
something like what else? Something like uh, Sunday for uh, J XML. I'm giving you some name. You can give any name of the problem. For XML. For XML, total is 16 rules are there. Out of 16, let me select uh, some of them. Okay, by mistake, I deactivated no problem. Okay, out of 60, I have selected some of them. How many selected means? Uh, XML, right? This one. Out of 60, I have selected six. Now I want to make this one as default. Now I have created. Already told if required, I can create a quality profile from the existing quality profile also. You know the concept, right? Yesterday I have shown. One more time I want to create for Java, um, something like uh, Today, quality profile for Java. This is the name I want to give for this quality profile. For Java, I'm creating. You can see this is parent, right? I wanted this one. Now, what will happen? This is what I'm creating just now. While creating this, I am mentioning this one parent. That means, whatever the rules already that I have activated in my QF1. Those will be inherited to this. That is what the advantage of the parent here. I think all are 19 activated, right? You can see now, same thing. This is the parent quality profile. This is the just now I, have, I am creating. So in this, so 19 are there, 19 was there earlier. So now I'm getting those and automatically. Along with this item, if you want to add some of, if you want to add a few more, you can add like this. I'm adding some extra. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Five rules I have added extra. I just have to do five only. Total like I said, 24. Well, oh, because all at 19, uh, I got uh, from parent, right? Where I can see that one. This is not Java. This one, right? You can see. 19, 24. Of course, if you see something here, you can see there's some structure like this. This is child of the first it is showing some like, like this. No problem. No, one more time, I want to do this project. M M sonar colon. In this step, I am not seeing something double and center way because already you know that one, right? If you observe here, in this, uh, I have this command. If you observe here, I am not seeing anything like uh, double and central way. We means already there, earlier it was downloaded, made it local and way. You know that concept, right? Now, if you delete uh, memory local repository, what will happen? What is the memory? What is the memory local repository? What is memory local repository? Dot m2. That's dot m2, right? Your home dot m2 repository. 
if you delete dot m2 again it will go to set of departure right so because right now it is maintained let me do that one i, I want to do that one also where is the dot m2 let me make it in out where is dot m2 you know right rm i fun rf i am deleting from where first of all it will show you let me show you first ll other home other home under other home Okay, why it is not showing means already you know right? what what why it is not showing anything? Why it is not showing dot m2 under other home only I am displaying yes exactly done it is that's why I have to dot right that means ls say from a now it is showing anything. Of course, same command I have, but I have an extra hyphen A. Of course, earlier it was showing only these two files. Anaconda kickstart file and audio kickstart file. This one or this one only show you because those two are the files. Remaining are hidden files. Hidden files are hidden files. That's why. Dot. Anything starts with a dot is called hidden. Except these two, you think are hidden, right? But this one, this is what we are discussing. Dot M2. Right now, in this location, dot m2 repository later something will be there. That also you know. But uh, after seeing power that I can know the different. Okay. Anyhow, from there I can get the uh, I am getting right now dependencies. Let me if you delete this one, once I need to go to central repository only. Let me show that one. Rm I from Rf, which I want to delete. Dot M right somewhere under other home. Dot M to M deleting. Now let me show you. Earlier that was there. Now I have deleted this one. Right? I have deleted that one. Not this one. Right. Now if you go to M V N Sonar Colon Sonar command. M V N Sonar Colon Sonar. Once again I am saying. This command is related to Maven only. MVN is a Maven command basically. Due to this goal, so if you create a solar generator, if you generate solar before, that's it. So already you know it. If you want to do any Maven command, first of all, it will try to check for the dependencies, right? You will be because the power account so many dependencies I mentioned. The corresponding dependencies first will take a local repository. If it is there, from there it will take. If any dependencies could not found in Maven local repository, what it will do? It will try to go and get it from the central repository. It will get those central. It will get those from central repository. It will maintain in the local repository. From there only it will take. That is what it, it happened earlier. Just now I have deleted local repository. So definitely. Right now, I don't have any dependence in local repository, right? So look at that different local repository itself is not there. Then how can I get those dependencies? This time definitely go to central repository. Let me confirm. And you can see. You can see that download center, download central. So many times I asked me, download center, download central. Now let me see the quality of numbers as you can see. For all the for, for uh, Java, my custom quality this is custom quality. This is also custom quality number. Right? Custom is I have paid just now. That's it. Okay. Now we work on this uh, quality gates. Quality gates. Keep it aside. Already have clear out project tab. I can this reports. Of course, today I have taken only one project. If you want, you can take multiple projects, right? Because already your three projects are there. Tab number, right? You can take those three and you can generate one report for all of them. Okay. Of course, if you observe here, I am seeing 15 course files. If you observe earlier, that was I think only six were there, right? Earlier, I have seen 15 away. 
We means uh, I am changing rules, right? Based on those rules, uh, definitely this was a paper. Okay, of course, let me show one more time. Right now, I am getting 50, right? 15 I am getting. We, we means I have used my own quality profiles. That's why I am getting 15 code smells. If you change the rules, definitely there is a change in this uh, number also. If you want to confirm, you can confirm. How to confirm means uh, let me change the quality profiles to default or let me change the default. Then quality profiles. For Java, I want to use for Norway. For JSP also, I want to use Sonar way. For XML also, let me Sonar way. I am changing now. I'm, I am instructing to take all the default quality profiles as Sonar way only for all these three languages. Right? Now, if you want to, if you execute one more time the same comment, definitely there is change in this sir. number. You can see one more time also. If you want, you can see. I am seeing one vulnerability and 15 code smells. Now let me do one more, one more time. This time it will take sonar way, sonar way, sonar way. For the three languages, there will be change in this sir, code smells under. One and put this count. Earlier that was showing like 150, right? 150. Now we can see this one is taking. Now definitely there is change, there will be change. If you refresh, you can see that one. You can see it right, one and six only. Definitely there will be change. Because the rules will change is different, right? Of course, of course uh, those by those rules, I am filtering something. Okay, any help? Now we work on quality gates. Already you know project staff, you know issues staff, you know rules staff, you know quality proper staff. Now quality gates. What is a quality gate? In quality profiles, we have used rules, right? But in quality gates, we do some conditions. Condition based on some metrics. Condition based on some metrics. Here also, they can have so many predefined conditions. There will be corresponding metrics for that condition. From that, we have to select some of them. Of course, I can define quality profile separately for separate languages. But quality gate can be common for all the languages. We are observed here, right? If you click on this quality profile stack, for C sharp, I am seeing separate quality profile. For flex language, I am seeing separate quality profile. For go, separate quality profile. Even for every language, there is separate quality profile. But in quality gate, I am not seeing any specific language, right? but I am seeing only one quality gate called sonar way. The default quality gate name is sonar wave only. It is for all languages. It is common for all languages. Right? Now, I want to create my own quality gate. My own quality gate. With some conditions. Some conditions means no need to write conditions. Already three different conditions are there. Among them, we can select some of them. Matrix also we can select. Okay. Of course, here definitely we cannot uh, track them away because if you observe in the output, uh, this is the command I'm using. I cannot see any word uh, in quality gate here. So because this is the common right for all languages, that's why it is not showing. But quality example I am seeing, but the quality gate I cannot see. That's why I cannot demonstrate practical, but internally it will use, no doubt. Internally, it will use quality gate also, that is different. But in this output, I cannot show that's it. That's what I am trying to say. Okay. 
okay anyhow i want to create one quality gate now how to create this is create but click on this under quality gate click on this quality gate create it is asking to you can see earlier we are creating quality gate is asking quality gate name for which language do you want to include parent or not so it is asking in this case it is not asked right so because it is for all languages right okay something i am giving mm. my quality gate for today i am giving something like this i have created this is the quality for my qg for today quality gate for today if you see here i don't have any conditions right i want to add one condition there is a add condition button right click on add condition it is asking to choose matrix so many matrix are there like complexity coverage okay duplicate code like that so many is so let, let me select some code coverage code coverage what is the meaning of this one if code coverage is less than something it is showing error but, but let me take like this try to understand what the meaning of this one if the code coverage is less than 30 error you can see code coverage is less than 30 error that means normally in a source code if we have 100 lines of code what are the new test cases we have written those test cases should satisfy at least two, minimum 30 lines otherwise this is the error the meaning of this one the code code less than 30 it will show error can i show like this can i have like this 90 so the mean right? at least 90 percent covers okay anyhow that is the now let me take 40 at least 40 percent of the lines are satisfied the meaning of this one okay yeah condition i have added you can see how really 40 percent less than that error the code code is for less than 40 percent error this error is not here okay if you want you can add one more metric also one condition let me add one more condition this time let me let me take one more like uh, duplicate code duplicates duplicated lines you can see <laughs> now you can see greater than i'm showing because there's a metric to change right if the duplicate lines are if the duplicate lines of code is greater than something like uh let me use 60 or 70 whatever what is the meaning of this one if you have more than 70 percent lines is duplicate then it error it is greater than based on the metric it will change now what is the meaning of this one i am adding i have had two rules now to check both the rules if the if the code coverage is less than 40 percent it is error if the duplicate code is greater than 70 percent also it is error those two cases i have added that's it This one I have created with these two these two conditions. Matrix I have created this one, or as a duplicate code. If you want, you can include some other matrix also. Right now, this is default one. Solar wave default one. In solar wave, default quality gate, right? This is the default quality gate. What they have considered, they have considered uh, a rule with four matrix, four or five matrix, code coverage duplication lines maintainability rating reliability rating security rating they have considered those four metrics now we have considered these two metrics in the project which one you want to include based on the requirement you can use this or this one of course here overall you can create if you want to make this one default select this one 
you can see there's a butterfly set as default. Now you can see this one is default. My QG profile for my QG for today. Now it is default. Now definitely to take this one as the this one it will use in the um, project will generate for your report. Of course, I can assume that uh, is going to reflect there or not, but definitely it will use this one. But this one, what I will do means uh, for more time, let me do it. Just now, sound for sound for just now. Just not created. But I cannot show you that one here because based on the matrix, the code is not that much accurate. That's why I cannot show you. But in real time, definitely you can see some difference at least like here and here. If you have a duplicate code, that I can display here. Okay. Anyhow. If you want, you can create some other quality gates with the, some other metrics. If you want, you can use the, those also in the project. Of course, not only here, if you have like 20 quality gates here, I can include them here also. Same thing. At the project level also, like the project, good administration, you can see quality gate, right? Quality gates. Here also, you can select what are the Call ticket you have to input in the file. Okay, that is also possible. Now you can try to create multiple call tickets also if required. Now we will see this administration tab. Administration tab. I right now I have logged in administrator, right? But in real time, definitely. You may not have that admin role. You may not have that administration role. Then how they will do? You, they will create your own username. Now I will show you how to create some users. Now I know one user called admin user. I want to create some users. How to create admin user? Of course, before going to administration tab. Let me try to change the port number. I want to change the um, sorry, port number. How to change? Already you know, right? Where you can see port number under solar cube con for properties file there, right? Let me open up where it is. Right now I am at somewhere else. Okay, don't try to open what are the files you require, wherever you are at. First of all, you have to understand where you are at and where is the requirement for that, right? Of course, if you know the path, you can open straight away. Let me open straight away. Where it is, means I know. I know means you also know if you understood the concept. Under OPT, what is the folder name I should have means Sona, right? Sona something. In this, under con, right? Under con. What is the file name? The property set this one. This is the file I require. In this file, I want to change the port number. This one, right? Let me change into something. I want to change it to. Something whatever. Let's use something like double line, double line, whatever. Double line. I am changing. 
I have changed the port number just now. But still, it is working with 9000 only. What is the real done? Already you know, right? The modification done. I have to stop and I have to start the solar cube service. First of all, let me restart the solar cube service. How to restart? Right now, I am a root user. As a root user, I cannot restart, right? Definitely, it should be a solar user. That's why let me switch to solar user. Sudo yes, SU iPhone solar. Now I am a solar user. Now you can see I am a solar user. Where I can see that uh, solar SH file, you right, under solars, bin under Linux, I can see that, right? Let me go there. Right now, I am at location means I am at home sonar. Let me go to that location where under OPT, under sonar, something like uh, under bin, right? Under bin. Let me see the Linux also, right? 64. If you go here, I am seeing this one. Let me stop and start. How to stop this one? Every stop, right? Every stop. That's why I'm not seeing this page, right? Now let me restart. Stop. Restart means stop or start, right? Now I want to start one more time. Start. That's the uh, thing. Now it is showing start there. Eh? Now let me see if it is accessible or not. Not accessible. What is the reason? Of course, let me see status here. Status, state, yes. It is showing running only, but I am not able to access here. What is the reason? What is the reason? You know the reason, right? What is the reason? The reason I have changed the port number, right? Earlier it was using default port number 9000. Just now I have changed it to double and double, right? That's why. Now let me change the port number to double to double and double. Now working, right? That's it. It's working fine. That means so, if you want to modify the port number, you have to open this one properties file. In this location, is there, I have opened that file. I have modified that uh, support number from 9000 to double and double. Nine. Immediately, it won't reflect. When it reflect means if you restart that solar service, then it will reflect. To restart, I have stopped this one. Later, I have started this one. Of course, start and stop. Definitely, I have to done. Those tasks as a sonar user, that's why I switch it to sonar user. That is also very important. If you try to let me try to do things as a root user, definitely it won't work. Let me confirm. Right now, I'm a root user, right? Right now I'm a root user. Let me try to stop this uh, term here. Of course, I'll already change, right? I, I don't want to change one more time. Just I want to stop. How to stop? Let me go to the location. CD, OPT, Solar Cube 7.6, Bin, Linux X64. I am at proper location. This file, right? Let me. Right now, it is running, right? So I'm running again. Let's confirm. Refresh. It's running, right? Now let me stop this. How to stop? Same command I am using. Stop. Showing stop. Let me try to access this one. Stop right now. Let me restart. Let me start. start. Let me start again. STRT. It is showing started, right? It is showing started.
Where I'm not seeing. It is showing started, but I'm not able to access space, right? What is the reason? It is showing started, right? Let me say status by the command. Yes, you can see. Of course, if you use this command called start, it is showing started and started, starting and started. But if you see the status, you can see. So it is not running. Okay. The reason is I have I am trying to start as a root user. Of course, if you execute this command, uh, it is showing starting and started. But uh, actually, it is not running. You can see. One more time also, I will use start. I will check the start. It is showing started. Don't rely on this one. You can search here. Otherwise, you can see the status also here. Then only you can confirm. You can see not starting, not running. Okay. You people also how to start and start the sonar cube service as a sonar user only. Okay, this is very important because normally you people without switching sonar user, you try to start this one. Of course, after this command, you are simply see, seeing started. But if you try to access this one, you cannot see. Okay. Anyhow, now I want to start one more time. Now root user, let me switch to sonar user. Sudo yes u i from sonar. Of course, is it required to use iPhone here or not required? Is mandatory to use or not compulsory? Sudo yes u i from sonar. This is the command that right now I am using. Now my question is, is it required to use iPhone symbol or simply press to press to sonar? It is also possible. If you don't use that one, I can in the same location. If you use today's iPhone solar, I can go to solar real home. Let me this. Mm, of course, you just have to right? If you don't use iPhone symbol, previously where you were at, you'll be there in the same location. The same location means this one. Right? Uh, what I will do is uh, I will go back to the root and I will come back. Sudo yes. SQ. <laughs> you can see this one, right? Sudo SQ. I am not in the icon here. Sudo SQ. That's why I switch to root, but I am still in the same location, right? This, you can see. Now root is right. Now let me use the sudo SQ icon sonar. Sudo SU I1 sonar. What will happen now? Of course, earlier I was in this command. Still, I am same place. But if you sudo SU I1 sonar, you can see right. Now I mean sonar is home. That's that's it. If you use this symbol, I can go to this user home. What are the other I have given there? I can put that together home. But if you don't use this I1 symbol. Still, I can there in the previous look that's it. Okay, anyhow. Now I am in this uh, sonar user. I am a sonar user go. I want to start uh, sonar cube, right? How I can start? I have to go to sonar cubes bin directory and uh, the Linux x64. There I can see one file called sonar.sh. I want to choose the file, I can see. Either running, stop, whatever I can do. Okay. Mm, I want to go to the location. Already know it where I have installed Sonar Cube means on row BT. This is the Sonar Cube folder name. There I want to go to build. There I can see something like Linux x right? I went to there. I am using here this one. This is the file that can be help us to start or to stop or to status, whatever. Let me check status. Of course, I can use this command of sh sonar.sh sonar.sh status. So not only really. not only uh, see this command also sonar.sh status. 
you can use this one or this one whatever dot slash followed by file name space status yes it's space file name space status both of them are same one right now i want to start as of now i start like this means like this right this is what i am doing right now but i can use like this also This one also I can use. Yes, it's the file name start. You don't see started. All right, all right. Don't rely on this one. Let's check us. You can see it's not running. Not running. Still not running. What is the reason? One more time to start. Not running. I think I have stopped that one by using a root user. That's why there is a problem. Let me stop one more time by using a sonar user. That's the problem. If you do those things as a root user, definitely it will lead to some problems. So that's why my suggestion is you try to start, you try to stop, you try to restart whatever you want to do. You have to do all those things as a sonar user only. Okay, anyhow. Now was not running already. Let me start it. The showing started. Let me say status. Still not running. So because actually I have top of that building was sorry, that's so why root is that. So what to do? Let me try to start by using a root user. This is showing started. That is not really right. Now we try to switch to sorry user. Pudo, I don't want to use uh, iPhone now so because still I want to be here only. That's why I am not using iPhone. Now let me start here. It's showing uh, started. Let me check status now. Still not running. <clears throat> How to record this? How to resolve this problem?
pseudo su i fun so on members are other boot let me go to the session go to the pin line access before and this location my file is there here so not a message start is showing start at let me just get us stated yes not running Uh, can you check once the, the file okay. permission? Okay. Right now, I am Sonar user. That means so, owner. Of course, what is having a user permission actually on this file? I will connect one more time server. Otherwise, let me restart server. I want to restart the server itself. Oh. Server in this one, right? How to restart a server? Check the server. Click on instance state. You can say reboot after that. Reboot. Reboot instance. Successful reboot yet. All right, that's right. All right. Is this command? Okay, I'm able to connect the server. Sudo SUI from Sonar. Now I'm switching to Sonar user. Now let me go to location, current spot location, where under OPT and other small group bin Venice X64, right? And I give two double slashes here. This is what the file required for us. Let me do SH sonar.sh start. It is showing started. Of course, you don't rely on this one. It's a status. S T A T S.
not stop and start. It is stop now. Let me start. Of course, you know, different side. If you reboot server, then the IP address won't change. It has rebooted. Now it is restarted, right? Now you can see differently. You can see the IP address change. Application will change. If you stop and start a server, there will be change in the public IP. But if you reboot, there will not be any change in the public IP. I am trying to track one more time. I have tracked only. Let me check whether that was one is there. So I can have it. It's not coming. Let me switch it to. Let me switch it to. So on our user. I have a sonar user. Right now, I'm at Sonar Users Home called Home Sonar. So home Sonar is the Sonar Users Home only. For any user, the home is slash home slash that name only. Okay, anyhow. I am going to OPD and uh, Sonar Cube name followed by that uh, bin right and the bin node like a three that one right and the bin and the linux 64 i am having this file and now one more time i want to start this one we are going to start it only so to the status let's take the status Of course, so I have some trouble to things steps. So, so let me. Sonar service is not starting. Make sure you need to change the ownership and group to OPT. I already have done this one. Make sure you are trying to start Sonar as a Sonar user. Check Java is installed or not. There are some more steps. If you get any problem, I can do this also. Let me check one more thing.
Because multiple times I have done so many things, that's why anyhow, anyhow I, I, I should be able to get it right. It is not running definitely. I cannot explain that uh, administration tab, right? What I can do? This conference will now be recorded. Okay. I, so I think some permission issue. Yes, of course, one more time, I try to change permissions and uh, ownership. Now it's looking fine. Okay. Uh, now I am... I am not able to access this page. Let me check one more time status. Still is running only. Of course, what I have done means uh, I have checked up. the VL sudo, that entry is there. Later, one more time, I am trying to change the ownership and the permissions. Later, switch to root sonar user, gone to this location, and I have started, this is started, but uh, I'm not able to answer this page or the reason. Port number. I'll change it double and double, number, right? I'll change it, right? Double and double. Number. And who is that? Let me see one more time that. Uh, from here, I can see that port number. You know this file, right? Where under 
OPT National Cube folder mm, that uh, con right under con the file for properties like right? this one. Which code now it is using? And the port double and double, okay. Oh, oh, sorry. Yes, I better change it, right? Yes, that's exactly. I better change it. I'll do right. If you stop and start, I better change it, right? This one. Okay. Now, there we go. No doubt. You can see. Look, right? Okay. I'll let you log in. Admin, admin only as of now. Now I will create some users. How to create users in the Sonar queue? Other than admin, I want to use some other names. How to create, go to administration, go to administration. Of course, I get so many things here. As of now, under security, you can see users, right? Click on users. Of course, here, there is one user called admin user. What is admin? Group have two groups are there. By default, two groups are there. In a sonar queue, by default, I can have one user. By default, I can have one user. User name is something like admin, right? Admin. Let me show you. You can see admin. This is the user name. Admin. Similarly, I can have two groups. Groups. I can have two groups by default. What are those groups? You can see groups. Sonar I for administrators is one group. I can have one more group also. What the group means? This sonar I for users group by default i can have these two groups if you want you can get other groups also as of now these, these two groups now i have only one user i want to add one more user if you add any user by default that user belongs to only this group if you add any new user if you add any new user that user will be added in this group only. Right now, this admin belongs to both of them, right? You can see here. Here's the name admin. Groups belongs to both the groups. That's why this person is able to act this administration tab. Okay. Of course, I will create one more user now. How to create user? You can see the create up right? Create user. I am creating one user called Bhaskar. Your name is Bhaskar. Name something. Bhaskar Rao. Email address is not mandatory. Only stars I want to give. Only mandatory things I'm giving. Or Bhaskar to give. B H A S K A R. That one to three. You can see. I have created Bhaskar user. That person belongs to only one group, right? You can see. Only this person belongs to only one group called Sonar Ekon. Users group. Right? Of course, you can generate token here also. If you want to generate token here also, you can generate token. Allow it all, right? You can generate token from here also, no problem. Okay, now let me draw more also. Create user. Mm, login. User name I want to create is like. Uh, what was the name, right? I want to create user Prasad. Prasad. Password P R A S K A D as that one to play again. You can see I have two users, master and Prasad user. You can see this person belongs to only one group called Sonar group. 
This path now also belongs to one group called same group. Now let me log out from this user. Now try to admit you can see here symbol, right? Admin, admission. Now let me log out for this one. And I am trying to log in as a Bhaskar user or Prasad or whatever. Log in as Bhaskar. Password which you have given me in this one. B A K S K A R. If they want to take a Definitely I have a good login, but I cannot see the admission as you can see. Projects, issues, rules, quality profiles, quality gates. What about that uh, admission tab? I am not seeing. Yes, we will make it as admins. We will make we will make it later. I just I want to show you if a user belongs to only Sonora's group for that user definitely I cannot have admission. That is what I want to show you later. I will uh, add that person to the Sonora icon administration group. Then for that user I can see the admission tab also. Okay. I am not in the admission tab, right? Similarly, let me try to log out and log in as a Prasad user also. P R A S Prasad. P R A S A D. Then one two three. I am able to log in, but for this Prasad user also, Prasad user, right? I cannot see the administration tab. Why? Because Yaza from this Prasad and Bhaskar user, both of them belong to only one group called Sona Apple. But with, that means they are normal users only. But here, what I am trying to say is if a person belongs to administration group, then only that person can see this admission. Okay. Let me try to change it. As a, of course, I, I don't have this tab, right? Let me go back to admin user because I want to modify for them. Admin, admin. Okay, now for them I want to modify. How to modify same for administration? Security, users, right now I mean this is right. Now I want to add this bus to the admission group. How to add? You can see right, there is a habit group of here. Click on this one. Yeah, as of now, this person belongs to only this group, right? Selected only this group. Go to unselected. You can see this one right there, right? Check this one. Now you can see both of them, right? Now you can see both of them. That's it done. Now you can see, right? This user master belongs to both of them. Similarly, I want to do for Prasad also. Click on this one. Right now, only select this one. Click on unselected. Now you can see this one. Select this one also. Now you select both, right? Same thing. Done. That's it. Now, as Prasad and Bhaskar belongs to this admission group also, now, now they became admissions, I can say. Now they are also just like admin only. That's it. Now let me log out and log in as Bhaskar, Prasad, either. What are the user? Either Bhaskar, Prasad. For both of them, I can see admission tab. I am Prasad user. Still, I am able to see this admission tab, right? How how means already this Prasad user belongs to both the groups, right? The other group as well as admission users. Of course, so now I am admission, right? Uh, of course, Prasad admission now. Now I want to show you something about this uh, token also. For this user, I can take the token also. Token. How to create token? Click on this one. You can see generate token. I can generate token here also, not only there. Previously, under projects, I have shown, of course, if you don't have any project, then, then only I can create. If you don't have any project here, then I can create token. Let me show you that one also. If you let me delete this one first. Already it is there. Already some project is there here. That's why I cannot create uh, token here. 
if you don't have any grade, let me show you um, code administration. Like this one, code administration, delete this one. I am deleting this project. Of course, if under project lab, if you don't have anything, then I can create token here also. You can see create new project. Now something I have given the name. Generate. Now you can see this token. Of course, plus Prasad is right. Prasad right right now. I have created one, one token there that we can form in the administrative tab also. You can see, I am seeing on count here. Why? We were count to show one. Why one number showing here means right now Prasad is there. I have created token through project tab. That's why I am showing here. If required, I can update here also. Let me show you. Already is there, right? If you want, you can remove also, you can see. Already is there, you can remove and update. Otherwise, you can generate something new, new one also. One more, something like new token. I am giving name as new token. You can generate also. Now I have two tokens. This one, this one. This is the new token. Done. You can see two tokens. I am Prasad Administrator now. Now this Prasad can be able to create uh, for Bath Prayer also the token. So because just administrator, right? Now something like this. Is that yeah. Yeah. Like that. I can generate tokens here and there. No problem. But here the important point here is if you don't have any projects here, then only through here I can create. But the project tab, if you have something here, definitely I cannot take token in this manner. In that case, definitely an administration tab, select the user, and security select the user, they don't again take. Right? Let me see what this uh, update data is. Change the password. I want to change the password from the other, let me change something. Update data is. Changing name, changing an email address, those things if you want, you can update. If you want to create some else, groups also, how do they groups? Same thing here on the groups, right? Groups. As of now, these two groups are there, the three members. If the three members are there, same admin user, pastor user, pastor user. this is also same, same as. Right, if you want to create some group also, create a group. Something like I want to create a group called uh, my own group. Group is my own group. My own group. Okay, something I have some description. This is uh, this is a custom group. Okay, this is a custom group created by me. Part of the ROUT created by me. Something I have Now I can have this group. If you click on this one, I can separate it right? Now, if you want, you can create, you can add members to the group also. Right now, no, no else are in this group. You can say I have three years, right? Let me add Prasad Rao to the this group. All is like this one, done. Now you can see in this uh, my group, my own group, I am having one else Prasad here. You can do like this also, whatever. Of course, our admission to this can't question, but the first one. You want settings, encryption, all those things if you want. This is very important for us. Of course, if you want to purchase this one, go to marketplace. You can see. As of now, I have taken three versions, right? As of now, I am using 
open source uh, kind of uh, sonic cube right if you want to if you purchase it of course normally industries they don't want to follow open source they will purchase license right for our practice purpose we are taking uh, open source work variations but they will take uh, purchase they will purchase right you can see under marketplace they will purchase under marketplace they can purchase dollar operation they can purchase interpretation or they can purchase data separation of course if you want to purchase this one what will happen you can see you can see if you want to purchase there you have to request trial otherwise you can purchase something they will view for uh, 40 days and to enter projection <coughs> they will view 40 days trial also for this one also let me go to this uh, data separation <laughs> Yes, they won't give it free. You can see there is no free trial for this one. Definitely, how you can see Sonar is the vendor of Sonic, right? In this website, you can see starting starts at something. If you, of course, I don't want to do it because if you go to this one, I have to pay something, right? I don't want to go this one. Just I am showing. Of course, in interview, if they ask, can you able to purchase this? You can say on the marketplace. On the marketplace, you purchase. On the marketplace. Okay. Okay. I want to stop here today. Tomorrow, we will continue with some other tool.